Welcome back to After Hours. We're here with Kev McKnight, Penn State student who invented the game Barrel Ball. We're going to play that today. Kev, thanks for coming. Hey, thanks for having me. You ready to play? Yeah. So the game looks pretty simple. It kind of looks like can jam. So how does it actually work? All right, so the barrels are 12 feet away from each other. Uh, inside, there's a scoring uh, scoring system mm -hmm. of three. The center ring is three points, two and one as you go out. Okay. And there's an instant win, I guess you call it bucket. Yeah. If it lands in there after bouncing around, uh, it's the game's over and whoever makes that. I've only seen a few. Yeah, I was going to say that so, is like yeah. a little tiny. I don't know how to get that in there. Uh, I mean, honestly, it's all... It's like 10% skill and 90% luck. 90% luck. All right. As long as it gets in the barrel, and then from there on out, it's, it's up to everyone else. All right. And how, do you want to play up to like five? Yeah. Do sure. that. All right. So Emily will be on my team. Chloe, welcome to the show. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I go, I go overhand, overhand or underhand? Overhand? I go overhand. Right. I'm more comfortable. Oh, oh. Wow. stop. Oh. <laughs> 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 Way too much. Three gears. Once you get, once you get, uh, once you, once you, once you get it down, it's a lot easier. You got to remember. I've had, I've had, I've had a little more practice. <laughs> So how'd you guys come up with this? Uh, we were actually sitting on the beach one day and we were looking around watching people play like all the other games. Cornhole, can of jam, golf, ladder, uh, yeah, ladder, ladder ball. Or... And uh, my dad kind of just, it hit. He was like, hey, I could totally make a game yeah. out of this. And it started off with us throwing tennis balls into a five gallon bucket for like, <laughs> a month and making up rules while we did it. <laughs> And then, uh, oh, you still one more? Whoops. Uh, yeah. yeah, go ahead. And then from there. <laughs> Wait, all right. <laughs> okay. Got some stage here. And then from there, we kind of took it from a five gallon bucket to a cardboard construction. Mm -hmm. And then when that started to break, my dad actually brought home can jam. And we were all excited about that. And then he cut it apart with a utility knife and formed, <laughs> and formed this. And that's how. And that's how it works. Yeah, after <laughs> dealing with different types of plastic, we had a couple prototypes, and then mm -hmm. now we're in our final. Yes, I'll start. Definitely our final, oh, final oh, stage. Yeah. Yeah. So where can you where can you get this? Uh, right now we're selling online, uh, barrelballgame.com on mm -hmm. the website. Uh, we're also on Amazon.com. Sweet. And we actually just got into our first store. It was. We gave them a few sets. If they sell, they buy it off. Mm -hmm. Or if they sell, they gain profit. Yeah. We get profit. And it works so you guys out are still so slowly, yeah. We're you're slowly starting. We're to in the yeah. yeah. We're in the beginning stage. I mean, really. I see no reason why this shouldn't take off. Like, yeah. I mean, we've had it. We've had it out here for a couple. I want to play this yet. <laughs> we've had it out here for a couple football tailgates, and people have walked by asking about it. Someone actually walked by and bought it straight off. Like, oh really? Out of my dad's <laughs> car. <laughs> What was that? <laughs> oh, Do you play softball? You can't you can oh, bounce it. Dude, oh, that's fair. That's fair. It was an okay team. It was just no good. Oh. What's your website? Is it barrelball? Uh barrelballgame.com. Barrelball barrelballgame.com. Yeah. What have you guys done to promote the game, like here at Penn State, besides the tailgates and stuff? Uh right now it's kinda of like I haven't, this is probably the first thing I've been able to do besides the tailgates. We've had it. Woo. Yeah, we play all the time. Hours exclusive. We play all the time on our front yard, so people have walked by and then inquired about asking oh. questions. Oh. <laughs> There's a rule if it technically if it bounces off a wall or a person, no. No. But but some people when you're playing when we're playing when we're playing in our apartment, we bank it off bang the wall, up. we do trick shots, make up our own rules. We do trick shots. Oh, I don't know any tricks. I saw the. <laughs> I, we just we just kind of peg it against the wall and see if it lands. I saw your video where you like kicked it in and did you make it in? I was trying to make it. All in. right. Was that no, real? No, that was that was a very poor. <laughs> I guess you're not. Been too light on this. 
And oh, 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 because if I be here, I'm gonna break stuff. That's but yeah, now we're uh, we're just hoping that we're actually going to a um, trade show in Philadelphia uh, in March. Over spring okay. break, I'll be actually home for it, and then uh, depending how that goes, maybe go up to New York with it as well. Mm -hmm. See, just get it out. Yeah, awesome. Well, Kev, thank you for uh, for coming to the show. Thanks for having me. Just had to play barrel ball. If you want to. Uh, <laughs> so we got two points. Uh, if people want to find the game and buy it, uh, where can they get it? Uh, Barrelballgame.com. You can order directly from the website, and you can get us on uh, Amazon as well. Just search Barrelball Game. All right. Thanks for coming, and we'll be back after the break.